What if I told you this one soap bar is responsible for all of these skincare transformations under one week? I'm going to show you how to properly use this African black soap and how it can benefit your skin the most. First, you should know what is in this miracle soap in the first place. Authentic African black soap should contain some, if not all, of these ingredients. Extra virgin coconut oil, raw cocoa pods, unrefined palm kernel oil, plantain skin ashes, unrefined shea butter, as well as purified water and natural vitamin E. It's important to know these ingredients because there are fake African black soaps that can damage and even burn skin. This reaction is due to the colors and additive dyes in the soap. The easiest way to tell is if it's not a pale brown color or a crumbly clay texture, it's not real. Real African black soap should not be dyed black. Now that we know the ingredients and as well as how to spot the real from the fake, Let's finally talk about how to properly use African black soap. We carry a variety of different types based on preference. So we have our whipped African black soap, which can be directly applied to skin because it is a smoother, buttery texture. And then we have our cleansing wash, which could be used directly on our skin as well because it's more of a foaming texture. And lastly, we have our authentic African soap bar itself. Here's where it gets tricky. Because the soap is so natural, it contains minor abrasions, such as small rocks or plant debris. This unfortunately can't be prevented because it is made within the soap. Since this is a clay texture, you want to go ahead and lathering your hands and you can still apply to your face daily to see results.